Where's that treasure map? Good morning, everybody. It's the Pirate Stacker coming at you Tuesday. Tuesday, Tuesday, Tuesday. And uh, today we've got some new stuff in from JM Bullion. Uh, we're going to be talking about the $10 a week challenge. We got a lot of fun stuff with that, but first, let's go ahead and shout out a few channels that I've been watching and you should check out too. Uh, Yellow Brick Bullion, neat channel. Pistol Packing Pilot, man, that's a mouthful. Pistol Packing Pilot, check him out. And Bullion Addict, I will put their links in the descriptions below. Uh, go say hi, check them out, see what's happening. We got a shot of rum. Cheers to you guys. Yeah. Mm. Breakfast rum. Nice. Uh, let's run through. I got an order in from JM Bullion. Let's show you what we got a happening. Uh, as some filler, I got three of these bars. Fingerprints all over them. Buffalo Indian bars <clears throat> and those are going in I'm currently stacking to make a sleeve of those so that makes uh, 7 out of 20 so whenever I got a little bit extra I'm gonna throw that on the order we're gonna fill one of these up next up that just came in with this order we got our Krugerrands we needed two to fill the sleeve. So that's exactly what we got. And these are just a neat coin. So again, this was one of my bulk coins that I chose. Krugeran is a highly respected, well-known piece of uh, coinery. Backed by a South African government. And this is actually going to finish off my mini tube of ten. So the cool thing about that is I can now move on to something else to stack. Oh, quick time out. We got this fella here, One-Eyed Willie. So <laughs> Mrs. Pirate Stacker, amongst buying all these awesome treasure chests, she saw this guy, and she goes, I just thought he was awesome, and you should have him on your channel. So there he is, One-Eyed Willie. He's pretty cool, and... uh yeah, it's neat. All right, moving on. Thank you, Mrs. Pirate Stacker. We got this guy, the Korean Tiger. Korean Tiger. And he's pretty slick. Look at that. And it's just a pretty coin. Now, I guess technically this would be a round. Really beautiful, though. Republic of Korea. I don't know, maybe it is a coin. I'll have to check into it. Uh, I purely got it. It is a limited mintage. It is cool. It's pretty. I wanted one, so I got it. We're sticking him in the capsule. Boom. Right in front of your eyes. Very nice. Uh, I picked up this one. This is the Perth Mint, the Double Dragons. Now, the cool thing about this, this actually came in the airtight, which I love when they do that. Saves me having to do it. Beautiful, beautiful coin. Great for your collection. And this guy. So this one, I kept this because I thought it was neat. It's a Scottsdale Mint piece. This is a Samoan coin. And it's got some kind of serpent eating somebody. <laughs> but what you can't see is the details are really awesome. And it says it's too tall. I mean, this, this may actually be a coin coin. Um, it's really beautiful. It's another one of those that it was just so nice I wanted it in the collection. But the detail is really impressive. The camera doesn't do it justice. Super shiny, really cool piece. And with that order, we get to our $10 challenge. Now, this whole box here 
was 250 bucks, nine pieces. So, you know, some neat pieces. Now, the one that we're about to talk about, boom, 866. Quarter ounce Monarch Egyptian Silver Round. So, I was making the order anyway, and I hadn't been out this week, and I was like, I'm going to do my $10 challenge piece. So, I went ahead and got this Egyptian Round. Oh, it's upside down. So, it's just a quarter ounce piece, and this is going to my weekly challenge box. So if you don't know what the $10 challenge is, now it's hard to see, but it does actually say three nines fine silver and what is that? My eyes are shot. Oh, quarter ounce Troy. Quarter Z zero Z T. So that is on there and that is important. If you don't know about the quarter ounce challenge or uh, the $10 challenge, so this is this week's pickups. I did score that dime for a buck fifty this week, and that is meant to go in the box because I knew I had the order coming. So that's my ten bucks for the week. Uh, I started this with Millennial Stacker four weeks ago now, something like that. And uh, basically, what we've been doing is every week we spend ten bucks. Now, what's cool about it is you end up picking up little pieces and odds and ends that you probably wouldn't normally bother with because you're only looking to spend 10 bucks. So you're looking for some, some kind of neater, more, more interesting things. Copper pennies one week. I got creative. So this is my $10 week challenge box, and these are going right inside of it. Boom. As you can see, now we're starting to get some treasure accumulated. Um, and I, I think there's a few other channels that have decided to join. I know there's a few uh, millennial stacker knew some people that were doing the $10 a week challenge with us. Uh, I want to say Silver Stallions is just starting up. Um, Piffs, the Pittsburgh fractional stacker, I believe he's joining in. So... <coughs> If you're just looking for something fun to do, this is fun to do. It's a $10 a week challenge. All you spend is $10 a week. You can roll over what you don't spend to the next week. You can buy one piece and go a couple weeks without it. But it's just uh, putting together something that's interesting. And it's a cheap way to stack. So basically you're into 40 bucks a month. And you're picking up mainly fractional stuff. But... It is fun, and it is a challenge, so join us if uh, you want to be a part of the fun. $10 a week challenge, Millennial Stacker, me, a few other channels. Let's see what you can find for 10 bucks a week, and uh, that's the challenge. So I'm challenging all of you to the $10 a week challenge. Um, we had some good pickups. I'm excited. I'm excited we finished that. We need to finish off our... Uh, our Buffalo Indian rounds and we can move on from that secret is I've actually ordered what we're stacking next uh, we've got this stack going now with the bars so that's good but these uh, these coins are very cool I'm really happy with these pickups they look neat they'll go great in the collection in fact these are going into the new treasure chest straight in put my my new stack back there and of course this beauty the Samoan very cool hey thank you for watching uh, please like subscribe ring the bell we come at you every day we're doing videos all the time it's a lot of fun uh, I actually have a little two-part series. I think I may start tomorrow. That's going to be very cool. So keep an eye out. We got we got good, interesting stuff happening here with the channel. And, uh, yeah, we're just having a good time. So get your silver in, folks. We'll see you tomorrow. Pirate Stacker out.